Ooh, through behind him, and the runner is going to try to score. The flip to Ward, and Ward got him! A huge tag out there. On day two of the Senior Legion State Tournament, Ashland Legion took on Sandwich on Sunday, July 28th. Sandwich plated two runs in the bottom of the third and hung on for the 2-1 victory over post 77. The loss put Ashland in the 2 p.m. elimination game versus Somerset on Monday, July 29th. The game was scoreless until the bottom of the fifth. Gets a piece of this one, ripped into left field. That'll get down. Lead runner, Nick Calabrese, being waved around, and he will score 1-0 post 77. An RBI single for Hornung. Top of the sixth, Somerset responded. The sky is getting more and more dark. Rain starting to fall. And this is hit in the air over to right field, and this is going to be all kinds of trouble. One run is going to score. Is another run? No. We're tied up at one, an RBI single for Will Tebow. After Somerset tied the game, some thunderstorms moved in and the game was delayed for about an hour and a half. After the long rain delay, some post-77 magic happened in the bottom of the seventh. We'll swing at this one, right back up the middle, and here comes the winning run! Post-77 lives to see another day of the state tournament. Kevin Balowitz scores the winning run, an RBI base hit for Jackson Hornung, and it's a walk-off win for Ashland post 77 over Somerset. Two to one is your final score. Ashland takes the win two to one over Somerset. Cole Glassburn pitched the complete game despite the rain delay and gave up only one run on five hits. Jackson Hornung went three for four at the plate, including the game winning hit for post 77. Ben Fink here, who uh, might have changed this entire game with the great walk that he drew. Ben, uh, I understand you have to say something to the, all the people out there. I'd just like to shout out Somerset's coach for making me play in the game. I only need one labor, but thanks, buddy. We appreciate you guys. <laughs> Thank you. There it is, Ben Fink, the hero at second base today. Speaking of heroes, Jackson Horn on game-winning hit today. Jackson, how fulfilling was it to get that hit? Oh, it was it was awesome, especially after waiting those two hours. I just wanted one more at bat and uh, came with that opportunity, so I just had to take advantage of it. And uh, obviously a, a very uh, defensive game today, some good pitching. Uh, it must have been frustrating not to be able to, uh, to leave all those guys on base early on and not be able to get the runs you want, but obviously in the end uh, you guys flourished and you're moving on. Yeah, you know, it was awesome. Cole pitched, pitched a great game, and uh, we had that one inning where they turned the triple play, which kind of – Kind of killed us a little bit, but we didn't let it uh, affect us too long. So then we just came back out there, scored a run, I think, the next inning or maybe the one after that. So, you know, just bouncing back after that was nice. So, Well, if there's one thing about you guys, you certainly know how to bounce back. Congratulations on a great win out there. Thank you. When it got delayed, you know, two outs, go ahead, runs to third base. Um, I knew if we got out of that jam, the game was over. Uh, there was no way that Cole, if Cole came out and was on, he's such a competitor. I knew he was going to finish that game without letting up a run. Um, when it comes to it, I mean, I'm at third base, Kevin's on third, Jackson comes up, I was like, all right, he's getting walked. Like, first base is open, like, you should walk him. Um, and even their center fielder screaming, walk him, walk him, walk this kid. And, uh, and he didn't, and he gave Jackson a chance to hit, and I think that was, uh, that was a tough decision, um, as you saw. Um, but our bats weren't there. We didn't have timely hits again. That's been really our struggle in state so far, is not having that timely hit. Um, but Jackson lacked it yesterday, and he came today and got two of them and drove in two runs. So, I mean, our mentality... Our mentality has been um, going into today was like surviving advance, throwing a lot of uh, 04 socks chatter around. You know, uh, don't let us win today. That was a big one. We got Cavs tomorrow. We got Gus after that. So, don't count us out. That's uh, that's all we're saying. That's all we're trying to do. Absolutely not. And how about uh, Cole Glassburn today going the complete game, coming back after that long rain delay, and his pitching was seemed to be just as effective. Oh, yeah. I mean, I knew I didn't really hesitate much going Cole today. You know, we have to get three wins to get to the state championship game. Um, and Cole was going to have to win us once, and I really liked the matchup he had today. Um, 
I knew it was going to be a close game. It was going to be a battle. You're in the final six. Every team's good, you know. Right. All of our games have been battles. They've came down the last couple innings. Um, but, you know, I had a lot of confidence in Cole. And you could tell how bad he wanted it, too. Um, and for him to sit out for almost two hours and, you know, I, I got Dom loose. I got Louie loose. I, I, was, I was a little concerned um, with Cole waiting around that long. But, um, you know, he just the whole time was like, you're not taking me out of this game. Like, there's no shot. Like, you're not taking me out of this game. And so, I mean, he stepped up for us all year. I was going to let him do it again, and he did. So it was awesome. Wow. Rain, rain, go away. We got to play this game and finish it right. We got her done tonight. We're excited. We're in the final four. And uh, we're going to keep going. We're going to keep winning till we lose. And we don't plan on losing. Thank you very much. Take care.